drugs, an assassin, and a maniac. I look around, you know what I see? Losers. But life is giving us a chance. To do what? Something good, something bad, a bit of both. Right, we are back in the Marvel Universe with Guardians of the Galaxy for this spacey score. We'll see where this ranks. And I think we're going to get a bit of a surprise, right? For you guys that haven't seen this table when we first fire it up. So let's get in there and see how she plays. Let's blow this joint. Right, let's get some more to the ship. With me. And that's right guys, straight away you're thrown into this multi-ball mode <laughs> right from the outset. I don't know if there's any other pinball game that does that. What a way to start. We are counting down here. 28 seconds left. Oh, fighting hard just keeping these balls going, but they do get shunted back out in the playfield, guys. So I really should be after these inmates and defeating them all rather than just randomly. Here we go. Oops, almost. That's probably part of the trick for this is to actually start looking for the shots. Let's go. All right. Ruth, That's the end. Look like a tree and get out of here. Is the end of that mode. I can't leave without my music. All right. Hit the cross ramp. There we go. A little tape player going. And into a bit of an animation here, guys. Your deaths shall be the most excruciating of all the worlds I shall cleanse. Aw, uh, there's no special treatment necessary for little old us, Ronan. <sighs> hey guys, he likes us. He Tried really to get him us. on the uh, on the shot there and couldn't make it. Trying to get a gauge on the physics. I think we're a little light. Making it a little bit ping pongy. Not terrible though. Quite nice connecting shots there. Ah, oh, take that left hand shot. What the fuck was that? <laughs> yeah, all right, fair enough. He did say truck, right? He did say truck. All right. Now, see if I can get this. Oh. Might just like way off there. Or do you have to get it like dead on? Got the ball save back. Jason Quill, you stand accused of corrupting the only Show law that all the flashing lanes. Pretty cool that you, you get the. Uh, accused of being the galaxy's biggest jerk. I mean, I'm no lawyer, but I talk about rock solid 
such arrogance. You wish to die here? Oh, so be it. Let's see what you got, big guy. Fire away. Just too much narration, guys. <laughs> nice little uh, anim uh, effects on the animation coming in there. But yeah, way too much narration. Just the the voice acting there, it's just a little you it's not great. No match for my power, Earthman. I have made my judgment, and the verdict is guilty. And that, that, that's okay, that voice acting there. There's a little bit of a guitar going on there, which is not too bad. Let's see if I can get this. Got it. Okay, it's just just gotta get it dead on, basically. Side. Just got the credits on that random reward. Music's sort of cranking, but it's quite it's sort of light, sort of light rock, um, which is which is cool. You know, it's not too overpowering. And it gives it a little bit of, compassion. yeah, not compassion, <laughs> sort of a bit jovial, right? Because of that little bit of a smile to the face. Okay, let's go again, guys. Again, we're straight into the. Uh... Your death shall be the most excruciating of all the wounds yeah, I, think... I shall cleanse. Oh, there's no special treatment necessary for little all of us, Ronan. Hey guys, he likes us. He really likes wow. us. Wow, okay. <laughs> Jeez, they fly out of there. No ball save. I should have tried to nudge that. Should be more lighting on those effects. Oh, hang on. Come back, come back. Yeah. Bit, bit of a brick around that area if you don't get it right. Just doing the demo of me bricking shots. But if you do get them, then it does, uh, does fly around the table quite nicely and satisfyingly. Peter Jason Quill, you stand accused of corrupting the only law that matters in this galaxy. Mine! stand accused of being the galaxy's biggest oh, jerk. Wow. I mean, I'm no lawyer. Yeah, this narration is old real quick. You wish to die here? Got to be so short on the narration, eh? Otherwise, it just doesn't work. Fire away. Quite nice when you connect those. You are no match for my power, Oh, 
Oh. I have made my judgment, and the verdict Ooh. is guilty. Pull three, guys. Seems to be quite easy once you get the hang of it. pick up. Hey, there she goes. Seems like you've got to do a lot of shots to make all the words. Narration has to come out of this game. You wish to die here? So be it. Let's see what you got, big guy. Fire away. I have made my judgment, and the verdict is guilty. All right, guys. I think that is it. Peter Quill, you are despicable, dishonorable, faithless. All righty, well. That was very interesting, guys. A little bit of uh, sound there, but as we look at the table and go through the scoring, oh, it's another table that had mixed feelings going into, and uh, yeah, it hasn't it hasn't quite lived up to what I thought it would be which is a little bit of a shame. But we'll go through the scores and see how it pans out. I think with the theme with the Guardians of the Galaxy, it's an awesome theme, uh, without a doubt, in terms of translating that into a pinball table. All the aspects and elements that are on this game are in line with it. Um, so it's pretty well executed and it's a great theme. I'm going to give that a 9 on the theme in terms of the atmosphere. It's cool. The music, as I said, was sort of jovial, but like light rock and sort of yeah, it was it was in there when all the sound effects and the look of the table, the call outs and that long narration just was killing the any atmosphere. It's just like no. So uh, that was a real shame. Um, but uh, you know, the atmosphere is still there and it's probably fairly reasonable. I'd give it about a seven. The layout. Um, can be good, can be clunky. So a little bit of a mix of both there. Sometimes you get a nice flow happening uh, and connecting shots and then it can be a bit clunky. So I think I'm gonna err here on more of a seven guys for the layout. Um, the table artwork, we have a look. Yeah, it's a little sort of basic. It almost looks a little bit sort of low res. Um, and, and you know, unlike the other other tables, it's 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 nice. It's not terrible, but yeah, it just looks. It doesn't look good down here. Um, so yeah, this mode A eh, is uh, is really crazy to start start on start a game on. But for yeah, so for the for the art. Um, I think it's more of a, I think it's a seven, it's in a six, but it's, no, nah, it's, it's relatively good everywhere else, so it gets a seven, guys. 
Uh, animations were okay, and there's a few punters on the table uh, all the time, uh, shooting at each other in bits and pieces. It's okay, guys. It's nothing amazing. Uh, we'll give the animations a... Seven. Graphical effects, there was a few effects in there and with the shooting and bits and pieces, the big morphy purpley thing that came up. Uh, again, not a huge amount though, so it's okay. I'd give it a six. Um, the lighting <clears throat> overall uh, is, it's a little flat to, to be fair and it doesn't pop and flash and do nice stuff to really light up different elements of the table so yeah guys it's just it's just a bit flat and a bit dull I think it gets a it gets a six for me on the lighting the DMD a rel relatively good 90s style DMD um, with appropriate animations and so forth it's in that it's in the mid-range area guys I'm gonna give it a seven the music, um, as I said, it's sort of, this is pretty cool. It's a little guitar riff here and it sort of, the, 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 the way it sounds, it, it helps in terms of you playing pinball. And that's, you know, again, where, where it's so hard with the Star Wars tables because it's like these orchestral pieces that are just really difficult to merge in with playing pinball. But this is sort of a groovy thing, you know, the ball's going around, it sort of kicks in with the music. Um, and the music's pretty cool when it uplifts the game. So yeah, I'm gonna give the give the music um, gonna give it a nine because it just ties in really really well with the theme and, and with the table. The sound effects uh, were okay. Again, nothing amazing, nothing special in there. Um, you know, I didn't actually feel like there was anything there that really jumped out at me. But they were okay. I'm gonna give them a six. Now the call-outs, uh, these huge amounts of narration, some of the voice call-out quality in terms of, um, you know, just the delivery of the, of the, of the call-outs, just a little bit un, un, unconvincing. But those long nar narration pieces, guys, is, is about as bad as listening to me bang on for an hour, guys, right? <laughs> no one wants to hear that. So um, it's 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 gonna be low because of that but not really rocket low i think you know it's about a four for me guys it just needs to be that needs to be removed uh, again the quality of the other stuff's okay but it's yeah it gets a big hit there flow of the table uh, as i mentioned sort of a bit earlier in relation to the layout the that the layout doesn't really help it i don't think but just also yeah it doesn't it does flow and then it doesn't and there's a bit of a mixed bag, so we're gonna give it a seven on the flow. The shot interest um, was relatively relatively good uh, as you started going around, but I don't know if this table has a huge amount of depth. If it does, guys, and I haven't you know, found it on these gameplays, uh, please let me know in the comments if this game's got more depth to it. It just seems like there's not a lot more to it than what we sort of saw. Um, so from that perspective, you know, with the shot interest and that might be down a little, I'm going to give it a, I'm going to give it a seven on the shot interest. It might be one too high, it might need to be a six, but I'm going to stick with the seven, that was the gut feeling. Challenge is reasonable guys, but it didn't, I wasn't really feeling like I was really getting challenged by it, I was more just flicking the, you know, flicking around and getting into it that way it was a bit of a casual sort of play so given the challenge around about a five the physics feel uh yeah a little floaty not too bad but it's not at the eight level it's not actually at the eight level i think it is more into the seven yeah it just felt didn't quite feel at that eight level i'm gonna get the physics a seven the fun factor another one i think that should be a lot more fun than it is and you know it's definitely fun with that beginning part but i think that scores somewhere else guys i think you know where but uh other than that uh, yeah and again the narration sort of kills your fun a little bit but i don't want to be too harsh on it i mean it still is reasonably fun to play guys um we're going to go mid-range on it i'm going to give it a five and uh replayability 
Oh, um, I first feel like it should be higher than 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 I, than I actually feel like it is. Um, there's just a, too many things in there that just drop it a bit below. But it, I will come back to it, and hopefully there is something more to this table, which I'll, you know I'll discover. But uh, for now, I think the replayability for me it's about a six. It's a six for me. I wish it was higher, I really do, just with the overarching theme, but yeah, it's a six. And then with the Spaces X Factor, I think, yeah, without a doubt, the uh, that initial mode, if you select it with the, you know, all the multiple reoccurring constantly, I think that's a cool little mode. Uh, I think the trick there, though, is you should be shooting for the targets and not worrying about the balls because they're going to just keep coming out, right? Um, so that was cool. That was a cool little X Factor. Uh, the little bit of guitar like licks in there and the way they've done that is sort of fairly cool too So gonna give it a little bump here guys and that might recover the table a little bit in the rankings um, Especially if I've missed something which you guys may already know of so I'm gonna give it an extra three points on the Spacey's X Factor guys That gives us a Spacey's floor And we'll see how this table ranks and, uh, Against all the other Marvel and all the other Zen original and licensed table guys so there you have it so yes again very interested in your comments down below please leave them like subscribe and all that stuff if you like this series and what i'm doing here with these videos i appreciate your feedback and anytime even if you don't agree with me i'd love to hear it and uh until next time ciao for now